Okay, so yeah, it should be live now, hopefully. So yeah, sorry about the delay in me trying to start the stream and stuff, um... But yeah, apparently, Streamlabs just didn't want to work for the past 30 minutes, so I've had a very fun time trying to fix that. But yeah, I'm back. Um, while I was gone, you know, nothing really happened. Uh, the Last of Us 2 release, I got review bombed, then or whatever. I just got a bunch of negative reviews. Uh, the Pokemon Sword had a direct, and then they announced Pokemon Snaps um, 2, and then the DLC release for Pokemon, which we're about to play. And then ARMS character reveal got announced um, for tomorrow at 9 o'clock in the morning, so I'm going to wake up at 8.30 for that. Um, and then the, they announced that Minecraft was getting an update on Wednesday on all platforms for the new Nether update, so I'll be playing that then. But tonight we're playing Pokemon Sword with the new DLC, um, and then maybe Animal Crossing if I finish the DLC. Although, I don't know. Um, and if the stream starts messing up, then I don't know if I'm gonna be continuing the stream or not, because it was kind of a bit finicky whenever I finish repairing it, like, two seconds ago, but yeah. Um, that's kind of the point, and so I started on this room because I didn't know if the DLC had a new opening screen. I've been trying to avoid spoilers and stuff. All I know is that Urshifu, it's broken, and, um, VGC Legal, and I probably just mispronounced it, but whatever. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Yes, the software can be played. That's my other switch. It's currently not in use. Which is my switch light. I have that one set to be my main switch. So that way I can play games without Wi Fi. So, so yeah, I'm gonna make sure the volume is not too loud for a second. Um, as I have it at negative 13.8, but it's probably gonna have to go lower because this game is very loud. Uh, no, that actually seems pretty good. Um, just tell me if the audio is messed up then. Uh, and yeah, I can fix that. It's not too hard to fix. It's not like the video's messed up. And that was what took so long to fix this because it decided to be very glitchy. Um, I might try to go through OBS instead of Streamlabs, although I don't really have things set up. Okay, so you have an, uh, an armor pass. Show it to the real stuff, Red Shirts, if you want to visit Isle of Armor. Okay, so yeah, we're about to do that. Um, I've heard that there are some glitches with bringing in new Pokemon, so I haven't done that yet. Um, yeah, just tell me if the audio is too quiet or too loud. Like, don't say anything if it's too loud, I guess. Huh? Or if it's, like, good. Huh? Um, so I have right on me. Um, I want to huh? see. Okay, that's not really what I want to do. I'm forgetting all of the controls here. Huh? Um, huh, there we go. So yeah, box 17 here is pretty empty. Um, all my other Pokemon are basically on my other Switch. Um, so, yeah, let's see. Which ones do I have on this one? I've probably got a shiny Charizard on here, but I don't have my shiny Venusaur. Yeah, because I have three shiny Charizards. Um, three or four, I don't remember. Um, this Blastoise is probably... Yeah, I was going to say I don't have a shiny Blastoise. I do have a shiny Venusaur, but it's on my other Switch. Like, all my good Pokemon are on my other Switch. Um, just because I use that one more often. Breeding Box, Box 7. You know, I probably should have put something in home, so that way I could have some decent Pokemon. I mean, I do have decent Pokemon. Um, let's see, this Arlex is pretty solid, so I'll keep him on the team. Um, I don't really need anything too powerful. I don't have Zacian anymore. I had to trade it away so I could finish the Pokedex. Um, but yeah, I've heard that getting new Pokemon in the Pokedex is a bit finicky with the new update, but that's supposed to be getting fixed, so that's why I didn't really bother with moving all my Pokemon over to this one. Um, I'll do it whenever it's fixed. I don't have a full Pokedex in this game, but I do on my other Switch. Um, See, so yeah, I'm just trying to see if I have a good enough team, and then we'll get started on the whole island thing. So yeah, I'm just grabbing some Pokemon of decent level. So maybe the Tome really had to be the greatest Pokemon like I got for Roger right here. Um, I got Yogi, which I used on my playthrough of the game. Um, Connor is not my Pokemon. Wait, did I use Yogi or did... I swear I would have named it something else. I might have named it Yogi, because I usually try to stick with the name. Is that original trainer? Oh, so that was me, okay. 
So yeah, sorry, it's been a while since I've played on this Switch, I don't really remember all the Pokemon's names. So yeah, I wanted to grab this Charizard as well. Um, just cause it's Charizard, so might as well have it on the team. So yeah, I'm gonna swap Charizard. And that should be good. Now I've heard that Pokemon can walk behind you as well. So I don't think so. Yeah, um... We need to head to Wetcher Station, I believe, so that's where I'm at. Um, that's Hammerlock, that's Mudstoke, he's like Axel, that's not... Is that Wetcher Station? No, Wetcher Station isn't Wetcher, I mean that makes sense, but... I don't remember where this place is that I'm headed. It's where you get the slowpoke, I remember that. That's the store. Oh, there's a poke chest over here. Pretty sure I don't even have that poke chest on my other switch, and I've done a lot on that other switch. Like, I have about um, 70 or 80 hours in Pokemon Shield and Sword, I think. How many do I have? I might have a comparable amount, actually. Oh, I have 73. I wasn't expecting it to be that much. Or, like, the amount of stuff I did in the game, I don't remember it being that much. Oh, here's the station. The train to the Isle of Armor has arrived. Those with an armor pass, please board the train. And also, in case you're wondering, I don't have the DLC for Shield yet, but I do plan on buying it. So yeah, I haven't spoiled myself on anything, like, as far as the story goes. I'm not even that interested in the story, I don't know why I've worded spoilers, but... Whatever. Uh, do you have an armor pass? Yeah, of course, I totally have one. Please allow me to check your pass. Hello there, Slowpoke. Did I see this animation already? Oh, a Slowpoke. Oh, it looks like another one's gotten on the train ridden over from the Isle of Armor. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Slowpoke blocks the ticket gate, it'll cause trouble for other customers. Slowpoke are actually pretty heavy, so do you think you can catch for me? Oh, so I didn't do it, I guess. I don't really have a good Pokemon to fight this Slowpoke without killing it. Though I already kinda have a Slowpoke. Wait, that's a square shiny? I didn't know that. Um, I transferred it from a different game, in case you're wondering. Um That should be good enough. Oh yeah, that should be good. <laughs> Got a critical catch. Or whatever that's called. Very good. Okay. So that is the first Pokemon from the DLC that you can catch. Name it Steve. You know, maybe I should use Steve. Thanks, um, Fudge. Here, there'd be a so in there, but okay. Thanks, Fudge. Slowpoke can be a big trouble move sometimes. Wow, amazing. The way you caught that Slowpoke was the absolute coolest. We apologize for the wait. We have checked your armor pass. All aboard train to the Isle of Armor when you're step on boarding. Hey, whereas there will be a connection along the way. Okay. Heading to a place called the Isle of Armor. I'm gonna catch some rare Pokemon and do some training. Let's hang if we meet up again, okay? Bye bye then. So, yeah, I guess I didn't do this on stream. I must have done it on my other Switch. And it would also be with the other trainer then. Um, we might battle this or this stream, I don't know. So, I'm gonna swap with Steve. Because I feel like we should be using the Isle of Armor Pokemon. So you know what I'm going to do, actually? I'm going to take all the Pokemon that I spent a bit of time organizing and putting in my party. Also forget a lot of the controls on the way there, but yeah. And we're going to keep Steve. Um, put... Big Boy, Cop Roger, Yogi, Roy, and Charizard back in the PC. 
Man, it's been a while since I called this thing a PC. You just don't really think of it as that anymore, but that's technically what it is. Um, anyway, I'm gonna save again, because I caught that slowpoke. Oh, that's an armor pass. With that pass, you can go to the Isle of Armor. Where would you like to go today? I don't know, probably the Isle of Armor. Oh, hello there. The Isle of Armor. So yeah, apparently you want to get the water typers as well. Um, but yeah, I'll probably use it in a team since it is PC legal for now, even though it's broken. Um, I'll probably use it as a stand-in for a, a different Pokemon that I was going to use on my team. I just have to find out which one. If Urshfu has like really slow speed or something, I could probably set it up instead of like Rhyperior, because I usually use Rhyperior. Um, is this your first visit to the Isle of Armor? I'm researching Pokemon biology here on this island. You want to register the Pokemon you catch on this island to your Pokedex, right? I'll update your Pokedex so you can do just that. Pokedex is being updated. The Isle of Armor Pokedex has been added to your Pokedex. Caught a lot of Pokemon on the Isle of Armor. Um, come back and show me your Pokedex. So I'm wondering if you need a separate shiny charm for this as well. Um, it's not like I'm going to be doing any shiny hunting um, on this Switch, though. Well, I mean, I might, because I, I have a lot of Pokemon on my other Switch, um, but I don't know if I have, like, every single one. I'll probably have to do a bit of catching. Like, I don't have Zacian anymore, but I got him registered on that Pokedex before I traded him away to make sure that, um, you know, nothing, like, I didn't miss it. Um, so yeah. Also, I really like this track. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm kind of just messing around. Oh yeah, I was going to see the Pokedex and see what that looked like now. So yeah, Isle of Armor Pokedex. Um, I've actually caught some, I guess, because... Um, so there's, what, 207? I think there's a bit more than that, actually, because I saw on the BGC thing that it said um, 1 to 210 were legal, I think, so there's at least 210. I'm supposed to join the dojo on the silent tape. There's a strange person standing outside the station, and I'm a bit too scared to head out. Ah, uh, there you are. Right on time, too. You're pretty punctual for a kid. Hey, if we met before or something? Oh, it doesn't really matter, I guess. You only saw me like five minutes ago. I'm Clara. I've been at the dojo for a while, so they sent me to help out the newbie. Um, what dojo? Oh, come on, I know you're the new student who's supposed to join the master dojo. Going on about being mocked by a kid? But I'm the colorful, caring, and charismatic Clara. Well then, how about we do have a quick battle, just so you know, and see who's better. Depending on slides, so come out when you're ready. Oh, um, I don't know what hit him. Uh, I might need to grab some Pokemon for that. Steve probably isn't gonna cut it. Um, so we'll get Big Boy. I do want Steve on the team, though, because he can gain some levels out of this. Um, I mean, I guess since he's in the back, it doesn't really matter. I'm sending in Big Boy first. I'll bring four Pokemon. And if those four can't handle it, then I don't know. Because they... This should say varying level, and I don't really know what to expect here. It's, I don't know if this is something that you do post-game, this is designed to be something you do mid-game, or the game will play. I don't know. Yeah, I bet this is your first time on the Isle of Armor. I'm not wrong. I bet you can't wait to start exploring, but first things first, we need to make sure we're ready. I've been at the Master Dojo for a little while now. I'll be the one testing you out. Go easy on me, okay? Challenge by Pokemon Trainer Clara. Oh, so we got two Pokemon in. One of them is the Manipede. Remember, this is just test. Take it easy. I'll be nice and doing all. I knock you out flat. 
Oh, it's a level 58 Minipede. That's where the challenge of this comes in. And by the challenge, I mean there's not really any challenge at all. It's really poison. Look, the first damage you took on the Isle of Armor considered a little gift to me. It's also my first knockout on the Isle of Armor. Oh, that didn't... Oh, wait, Storm has a lot of health. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, hmm. There's actually... I don't know what type um, this slowpoke is, so... How am I the one getting back into corner? This should not be in or happening. I didn't really see what's at the end there. What type is slowpoke? Psychic. Okay. Flinch. Yeah, that's right, let me poison drive you creep or clone freezing. That was a fair bit of damage. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention earlier when I was talking about things that happened while I was gone. Um Jotoli in chapter ninety eight came up. That and it's pretty good. Um, I actually want to say one more room. Probably a mistake. Oh, my next Pokemon is gonna make short work of. Huh? That was my last one. No, no, no. No, no, no. There must be some sort of mistake. Not good, not good at all, man. How did this kid get so strong? This kid runs through our dojo, nobody's gonna pay attention to my string. Could just tell him to buzz off. No, they asked me to bring in the new student. Hmm. That wasn't bad. I mean, it's not like I was going all out, not at all, but still. Uh, but you see, our dojo is, is the one that's got a long standing reputation. Even the famous champion Leon would tend to. I think it's what that said. I kind of skipped it a bit too fast, my bad. Uh, no offense, but maybe, just maybe, you're not quite good enough to make it. What about this? Why not enjoy the sights, but just stay away from the Master Trojo over there, okay? I'll give you this, you know, a souvenir. Final card, a card that increases the selection of boutique and hair salon. You should show it when you visit a boutique or a hair salon and they'll let you buy stuff that's not available to most people anyway. Guess that's you never. Oh, and it's got a movable camera, and there's a giant whale lord. Warehouse C. That is certainly a name. Just look at the size of this thing. I wonder if the shiny whale lord's that big. I mean, I would assume so, because I have one on my other switch, but. It's tentacle Pokemon that's in the default Pokedex, or is that a new one? Because I'd rather not catch it unless it's new. Because I want to use Pokemon that are new on this run. I don't really want to bring back the old ones. I only brought those ones back because I did, was not aware of what type of Pokemon I would be fighting whenever I walked in the door of the island. I mean, I might as well catch it anyway, since it looks like I don't have it registered. Looks like I've got not that much of a choice to repeat out. Large boy coming in. Well, that Sharpedo is in fact level 60, and I'm pretty sure it's a new Pokemon, so I'm gonna be throwing it out for a lot. Okay, did not even get close to work, but it was a good attempt. That did a bit more damage than what's expected. Um, so, I'm going to use a potion. Um, that is not what most people would consider good. That 
that's a move. Flinch. That's a bit worse. Okay, we lived. This time, for sure, it's gonna get caught. I end up running out of Pokemon. I'm not losing this battle. Um, that's for sure. But, things definitely don't look that good at the moment. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in Roy, and Roy's gonna use Burn Up. Because Burn Up's not gonna kill. Exactly. And it's also going to get rid of my fire typing, so that way, when I get hit by the next water type move, it does half as much damage as usual, but it's still boosted by rain, which is a bit unfortunate. Okay, so sharpedo has been caught. Crisis fruit. I would have liked to have a low-level team, but I don't know if I can, because I walked in with strong Pokémon. Um, water pools. No reason to have acid. Um. I don't have a name in particular, so I'm just gonna go with this. So yeah, we're not putting Waylord on the team. We've already got one water type and that should be good enough. Um, oh, a bag of Sardis, that's pretty good. don't really need another water type. Um, hello there. Goodbye. Okay, so you're not a trainer. You touch clear, clean sand helps you cleanse the memories of toil that you've been through. Oh! So that's how you reset... Um... Your EV is it's pretty nice. I will be training up a team. I've been working on one for a very long time, it's just that I've been distracted doing other things, so I haven't really had enough time to finish it. But I'm working on getting a hidden ability, Dustclops. Because I know that Dustclops is basically going to be useful on any team that I make. Oh, that's a Ditto. I was wondering what that was. I kind of already have a shiny Ditto, so I don't really need one. But if you are shiny, then I will take it. I have a shiny imposter video I got from the raid. Also, why does Big Boy look shiny there? Okay, very cool. But I do have to go. Imagine telling me that I can't run away whenever I can just, like, body it. Oh, execute. Get a good grass Pokemon for the team. Good to bait him. Um, I'm gonna hit it with this body slam and it will paralyze. Perfect. So then, I'm going to bring in Steve. This is a bit risky, because Steve does get one shot here if they don't go into this Pokeball. But I mean, they have a pretty high catch rate because they're not evolved, they're paralyzed, they're in yellow health. So I'm pretty sure I didn't even need to Ultra Ball them there, but I just did anyway to be safe. So yeah. Go Steve. I wonder when Steve evolves. Um Eggy. Okay, so Yogi. 
Jamie's been removed from the party. Um, we do not need Steve in the front of the party. We don't really need anyone in the front of the party because they're kind of all not doing too great. Um, I don't think I have a leaf stone on me, so I cannot evolve execute. The camping gear upgrade, I haven't seen it before, I guess that's why. Um, and we got the new style card. So, do I have a stone? I don't really have that much. Oh, actually, I actually do have a lot of time in my hand. I was gonna say. Um, I guess compared to what my other switch, I don't really have that much. I wish I could stream off the switch light. That would be really nice. Oh, I do have a leaf stone. Very cool. Once learned stomp. Let's see what moves that Peggy has. Uproar? Yeah, that's getting replaced by stomp. Okay, so we got Ditto. And we got... Execute here. Who else spawns on this spot? Well, I mean, we can't really test it as my team is kind of dead. I need to find a Pokemon Center. This island's been somewhat dangerous. I lost two Pokemon. I haven't game over it yet. But I mean, it's definitely a lot harder to explore than the base game. Hello there, Sharpedo. That speeds me on my bike. I'm just gonna do his favorite tactic. That's bad. Okay, never mind. You know, I didn't come here with like my OCS or anything, so I can't just one shot everything. Existence. Makes things a bit harder. Um, also, I've got um, the Deluxe version or whatever, because I bought them onto that, so I, I can move all the Pokemon I need to. Ooh, there's a Polyrath. That would be very nice to have. Wait, what am I saying? It's another water type. Well, I mean, Polyrath's gotta be a decent Pokemon, I feel. Wishmere got added. I don't know how I feel. Politoed being added is pretty epic though. Um, so yeah, I don't think I came the correct route. I wouldn't mind doing a raid, kind of, just because... Doesn't that, like, completely heal you? So what is that? Oh, Chansey is in this game. Poofoo wants... Probably mispronounced that. Rock Ruff's back. Oh, I actually have, um... Shiny... Dusk Lichen Rock, I believe. So yeah, I can put that in... You know what, I'm actually gonna move some Pokemon from home on stream here, if you don't mind. Because, um, yeah, I've got some interesting pokes that I think would be pretty fun to have. Okay, so where is Pokemon home? There it is. Please put a game on here. Because it's not a game, really. Wait, did I sort that by playtime? I didn't think Cuphead was that low. I must have beat it a lot faster than I thought. So yeah, we're in Pokemon Home. Kinda obviously, but yeah. Um, kinda sucks that you can't transfer your Pokemon from home 
to your Switch if you don't have the DLC. No. Okay, so I gotta go through the terms and service. connecting to this game. So, oh, Makirna could be transferred, right? Yeah, that's new. Okay, so we got Makirna. I thought I had a Mew on the Switch as well. It looks like I don't. Deoxys can't yet, although I feel like that's going to be in the next one. Um, Makirna, Blob. Ultra Beast can't be yet. Oh yeah, I forgot that. Um, oh, Ari can. Or for far, yeah, um, Talon Flame can be transferred over. Oh, they've put Marowak back in the cube on. I'm not going to be transferring every possible Pokemon. I'm just going to be transferring the ones that I think are going to be interesting to have. We have got Rock Rough. Gyarados, Krogonk. Um, I don't think Pinsir was in originally. So he's been added. Um, Zerora has been added. Cubone. Um, just trying to see. I know that these aren't going to be registered to the Pokedex, but those would be fun to have. Um, was Psyduck in originally? I don't think it was. Well, he's in now. So. And there's that. Another Blastoise that I have there. Um, oh, I thought it was saying that um, Sceptile was in. That's a bit strange. But yeah, I have a bunch of uh, Japanese Pokemon due to like Wonder Trading and stuff. Because I like to Wonder Trade to try to get um, Pokemon that I can farm through the Masuda method, although I have a foreign ditto now. Although it's, it doesn't have perfect IVs or anything, so I can do a bit better. Um, Tyrantrum is not back, and then the tank and stuff isn't back either. Um, Tintacruel. I feel like Tender was added. Um, although I'm not too sure. I don't remember it being in. Poliwag was added. I'm gonna get Golduck as well, just in case Psyduck wasn't added in originally. Um, there's another Pikachu that I have. I have like 50 Pikachus in Pokemon Go, it's kinda bad. Um, mainly because I don't really have that much space. Oh yeah, I forgot they added Magnezone back in. I really like Magnezone. I don't know why, I just always like the evolution line. Um, I don't think I had to go in already, so you're there. Um, at one point I had all the starters, so I don't think I do now. Oh, maybe. I'm gonna put Charles in. I think Charles comes from Pokemon X. That was like the first Charizard that I got. I don't think Lunatus was an original. Well, maybe. Oh yeah, Porygon got added and I forgot that. I had read about it. Okay, so yeah, I don't think I have a Porygon scene anymore though. So yeah, there's the shiny Lycan Rock. I don't know what form it is. Politoed. I'm kind of bringing in Pokemon that I think will help me complete my Pokedex and Sword as well. So yeah. Uh, this is taking a bit longer because of that. Um, cause I'm not because sh obviously I only had 186, I think, registered to the Pokedex, and it'll just kind of save time. Although not really, because I'll probably transfer all my Pokemon from Shield anyway, and then like take them out or something um, to save time. I don't think Pseudo Widow was originally in. 
the license. I don't think I have it on there. I might not have had a blooper on there. So yeah, put that there. I was gonna bring Bart Boats as well, and I thought I could drag them together. And then I thought that I couldn't because I didn't have enough space when I saw that bottom road down there, but by then it was already too late. Um, so yeah. Hopefully. Sherman. Dwayne. Um, I already have a talk, so I saw that in there earlier. Nothing there can be transferred. Clef Key. I don't think Clef Key was originally in, so that's good. So yeah, that's just my good Talon Flame. Licky Tongue got put back in, that's weird. Sadly, Crobat's not back yet. Crobat was in like every game too, and they just didn't put him in this one. I don't know why. Linton's in. I just hadn't brought one over. I'm gonna bring all three of these. Just I don't know if I already had them. A few did, it was scattered about. Blaziken's not back yet. Blissey is back though. And I think that's all my spots. Right, unless I missed something. Let's see. I'll put this one in as well. Oh, that one came from... Let's go then. I didn't even think about that being a possibility. Um, Slipper. Bray. Watch, I'll go back in my Pokedex one in case. Oh, they put Alex Zan back in. I actually like Albert and Alex Zan and all of them. Um, I'll have to see if I have the other ones in here. I should somewhere. Polyworld. Regular slow burrow. That'll help save time, because following that Pokemon's a bit annoying. Comfy's back. So I guess they added a bunch of Alolan Pokemon back, because it is an island. Is what I think they did. Hellfish. Don't have that. They did not put back in Spike, it looks like. I can't see now at this point, I've basically just gone through and tried to get all the ones that I'm missing that are in here, that I think I'm missing. I might actually have them. Like, I don't know if I have an extra drill in here, but it's in there now, so just be safe. Um. I really need to organize this thing a bit better. There's gotta be some spot in here where I can put these down in the top row. I would include the Pokemon that can't be moved. Oh, those two Pokemon. There cannot be moved. Got it. I thought they could. Oh, Sally's there. I should. Bring Sally, I think, just because it was the first Pokemon I got in this generation. Even though it's not one from Isle of Armor, um, I just would feel wrong leaving it out. That being my starter and all. And Alex Sim. The name looks spelled weird. I saw that I had a Rogman already. Um, and I'm assuming I had Gear Ghost, but just to be safe. Um, let's see. I doubt I have Lombre. 
Well, that's an important one to get. Snow Runt's pretty important. Rapid Ash as well. Um, everything for that box. Two. Um, go ahead and bring those two. Oh wait, Scarberry. Squall. Was Scarberry in originally? I don't think they were. Sandshrew and Trubbish. Beware. My box is very disorganized now. Um, It'll probably never be fixed. As well, as there's not really too much reason to do so. Um, for this switch, because I never really play on it. Um, eventually I'll search for it once I get my team built, but it's gonna be a while before that happens. Um, so yeah, that should cover most things that I wanted to move here. But yeah, sorry this took a bit longer than expected. I actually have Cadabras, I have the whole line. I have another Magnezone. I don't think it will be put it, um, evolution line was in originally. Save what ability? Okay, so that is a schooling one. Um, so, yeah, that should be every Pokemon that I will hopefully ever need to move for now. Exit and save for sure. Okay, so yeah, sorry about that, I just wanted to get that done, so that way I wouldn't have to do it later off stream. I mean, it wasn't too bad, just move a Pokemon. Um, it wasn't like me moving items into a storage area in Terraria for two hours, which I did while I was gone. So I did bring my laptop with me. Um, Hence why it took like 30 minutes to set up, because I ended up putting everything back in. Um, so yeah, uh, hopefully next time that I bring my laptop anywhere that doesn't take as long. Um, so yeah, let's see the Pokedex now. Oh yeah, 207, increased by like 20 Pokemon. Um, so yeah, as I mentioned, uh, let's go to boxes here. I do want to bring Sally with me. I don't really feel comfortable bringing in other Pokemon that I've already caught and stuff, except for like Sally and then um, the shiny that I brought over as well, the shiny um, Lycanroc. I'll have to find it. There's a Ternatus. There's Sally. So where did I set the Lycanroc? It would have been before all that. Right. I messed up a lot there. Okay, so let's go to L. Well, I can rock not be searched for, that's good. Makes things a bit harder. There's Litten. So that Slowpoke is level 37, so I'm assuming around level 37 he will evolve. Wait, I had a hidden ability Litten this whole time? I've been looking for one of those for the longest time. Uh, I still need hidden ability, um... What is it? The Primarina. I still need hidden ability Primarina. And there we go. Yeah, in case you're wondering, I did get that from trading, if you can't tell by the name. So yeah, that's almost a full team. Um, I guess we take Litten too. It's not really going to be good for CV training, but... Or no, I'm not taking Litten. Um, we'll just catch another one eventually. Um, 
So yeah, that should be good. And I thought it said that Pokemon follow you around on this island, but as you can see, there's no Pokemon following me around. Maybe it just hasn't happened yet, and it will happen eventually. And I just need to wait. Got a Bulbas flying through the tree. Got a Bulbasis. Bulbasai, I don't know. So yeah, I don't think we would go to these towers just yet. I did want to see what this is, though. I might have already looked at it. Did not, and it is a Maybe Marowak, I can't really tell from that alone. Um, so yeah, we're gonna fly... ...back to the checkpoint here, and actually start this thing. Oh, I know what Pokémon will do. Um, for that other slot, we'll do, um... Kubfu. Easy. So yeah, this place doesn't look too bad, um, design-wise. Like, the graphics are still graphics of Sword and Shield, so they've got that issue. Deh. 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 Lola and Diglett, hello there. Oh, Diglett, you're here. Ah, you little rascal, I was worried about you. Now you're finding my Diglett. Is that from Alola? Didn't expect to meet someone who knows about it. That's right, this is a Diglett from the Alola region. When I traveled in Alola, I fell in love with these adorable three hairs. Caught a lot of the Diglets and came back, but they went somewhere when I looked away for a second. Man, they travel fast, and my Diglett... I already found a Diglett buried in the ground. You definitely have a talent for finding Diglett. So if it's okay, um, will you find the other Diglett too? Yes. Oh, what a kind person your words can express how great I am. Found one Diglett so far, so please find 150 more Diglett. You really have 150 Diglett. If you find them, please tell them to come back to me. Okay. So that might be something for off-stream. I might get the final Diglett on stream, but I doubt people want to see me running into 150 of these. There's 17 more in the field of honor. Well, there's one right there. They're not too hidden, I guess. That's kind of a good thing. Still probably going to be doing it off-stream, so that way I can look at my laptop and just find them. Off of YouTube. Um, oh, Fiddle Six, our new student decided to go back home. Seems that way, yep. I did my best to welcome him, but suddenly left after a battle. I'm hoping that we get to welcome a new member to our little family here, too. Well, hello, and who are you? Huh? Of course, you must be the new student supposed to join the dojo today. Uh, sure. Right, 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 right. Exactly, ma'am. I swear, he must have changed his mind about joining the Totra. Oh, but here you are. I'm so happy you decided to come after all. Oh, everything's just coming up roses. Now I'm quite sure they already told me your name, but... Unpaused. That's right, you're unpaused. Where's your own? No, I'm rather sure that's not the name I was told before. I'm sorry, I keep help this place running. Um, you can consider me the lady of the house, not that the Master Dodro is just any old house. Why? How? What does he think he's doing, just showing up like that? I think Ted Masani will know that I lied. I think we've already met Clara. Bit of an odd deck lit, but she's one of our own. She's training hard here at the dojo, so she can become a champion leader someday. I can trust two of you to come along, right? Yeah, I'm sure we'll be just best friends. Oh dear, look at me. Here I am making you stand around outside after you've come all this way. Come on, come on, don't mind the faint stench of sweat. Listen to you. If you dare tell Miss Honey what happened at the station, write you down the slides, you understand? I feel like you're being watched. Why didn't they put Greninja? I feel like Greninja would do pretty good there. Like, you know, you could have Ash Greninja or something. Also, there are like two Diglets here. Um, so let's go ahead and get this one. Let's 
16 more diglets in the field of honor. I feel like you can just walk up to them, but no, you have to walk up and hit A. I feel like you can just walk on top of them or something. Honestly, if I had to guess, there would be a Poke crate this or a Poke chest this way. Ooh, one of the new teams. Where's the TR, actually? Um, Focus Blast. No, wait, I think that Focus Blast was in the game originally. Yeah, because I have a mutual that has it. So, got an HP up. Fancy apple. I'll use the HP up on, um, Two hundred watts. So yeah, just kind of doing a bit of exploring before we head inside, like I was earlier. Um, seem to have an awesome bike. Let me customize it if you'd like. I'm a bike lady. I love planes and bike maintenance. Do you want me to customize your bike with the design I came up with? Yes. Um, sparkling white, glistening black. I guess. Your bike was shine with special coating. Okay, hold on a second. Customization complete. Enjoy your ride. Run a bike stuck listening. Um, come back anytime you want to try a different customization. Oh, so this is a bike I've been seeing everyone use. The Soothing Wetland. I think I was here earlier, so... There were no diglets last time I was here. Hello there, tiny whooper. Seems like there are a lot of whoopers. Um, also, I was going to mention that um, that's not a hidden ability Pokemon there, because that was my starter. Got some Black Sludge, that's always good for Poison types. I don't think I have any Poison types on my team, though. I can check that. I don't, because that's like, a, for some reason I was thinking that was Grass Poison. Nope, it's not an Oddish. Oh, there's Lucky Lucky. Um, I don't actually have Lucky Lucky, so. Might as well try to catch it. I keep running into all these Pokemon, and yet I still haven't encountered a Poke Center or anything. It's not like I'm doing a Nuzlocke, though, so. Should be fine. I'm gonna hit it with a Snipe Shot, it shouldn't kill it. Unless it crits. No, I think I saw that I had Swift, yeah. This shouldn't kill. Ooh, power up's gonna hurt. It did hurt. No critical catch. Ooh, it didn't get caught there. Oh, really? The Pokemon here are definitely a lot different than on the original island. So yeah, sure he's getting power whipped if this doesn't work. It didn't work. Oh, it avoided the screech. Licky Licky does not want to be caught, and I don't understand why. You know, I can just evolve my Licky Tongue. I don't have to catch you. That could have been bad. <laughs> I didn't even think about that being a possibility. I'm just glad that it did not happen. Yes, that would have been a bit bad. Um, let's go, Eggy. You got him, Eggy. You can do this. Just don't die. It's simple. Everyone else before you has died, so. Got the critical catch. That should be it. There we go. See, just required, Eggy. 
and my entire rest of my team getting wiped. But I mean, that's fine, Sharky didn't need XP that badly. Um, forget an old move. We're gonna forget Disable. Yawn's got some use. What if he did, like, Yawn Disable and, like, tried to do, like, Sleep Talk or something? I guess... Would it... If you disabled a Pokémon using Sleep Talk, would it put them in a position to where they would be out of useful moves and hit themselves? Proxy. This team is not very good, but it will work. I don't really want Licky Licky in the party, if you don't mind. No offense, Trissa. That, that spot's kind of taken already. There you go. So yeah, let's check out the Pokedex so far. So, how many do I have registered in the Isle of Armor? Caught 58. I'm just wondering if it has the Pokemon that I transferred registered. Um, so I'm trying to see. Such as, like, Lycan Rock and stuff. Because if not, what you do is you put them in the daycare and then take them out. And apparently that works to register them. But I'm just wondering if they're even in there. Um, now, and it looks like the answer to that would be no. So yeah, because there's no rock rough. That was one that I was looking for. So yeah, I mean, it's fine. Um... As I said, I don't really care for completing the Pokedex on this switch too badly. Like, I wouldn't mind it. I'm gonna try to do it, but I mean, if I have to catch, like, 30 Pokemon, I'm probably not gonna do it um, and just use my other switch. Because, I mean, having a full Pokedex on my other switch is a bit more important because I use that switch more for, um... Let me say, what happened to my pocket box? I know I have one of them. Yeah, these like invisible woofers. Also, this bike is really cool. I've got an announcement to make. We've got a new student joining us today. Please welcome on pause. I'm sure you'll have a lot to teach him. Yeah, welcome to the dojo. All our students are so good and hardworking. Everyone really gives it. They're all around here. Now here's someone who has li not listened in my database. Or, it's not listed in my database of students. Oh, sweet five is not usual for you to go. Or to bother greeting a newcomer. This hide, my darling, only son some kind of outlier here. Um, you should give this a try. And an EXP charm. A charm that increases the experience points a Pokemon get. Stream like object inside the charm. Oh, so that gives you more XP per fight? Don't open it, okay? It's got tagged I developed inside, I don't want you to go and ruin it. So good with his hands always being something new such a boy. That handsome jet in the back is my darling Javi and very master of the Stojo. Hello there, my name is Mustard. Rather good at Pokemon battles, you know. Please, it's trees that you can join us. Nice to meet you. Such a quiet student. You seem to be the hard working type, too. I'll let him fool you into thinking he's just silly old man. He's a real beast when he gets serious. Well, darling, I'll leave the rest up to you. Hey, this is my favorite part. I want to see just how good you are, so why not have a battle with the wall? I mean, say the word when you're ready. I need healing. That's 
what I need. Can you heal my Pokemon? And then you want to know about Dota Jump Penn State to ask somebody else. Okay, good. Um, why is there a kitchen? I guess they live here, I don't know. I mean, it does make sense. But... Is tired? Okay, so there's where we rest. That's what I've been wanting to see. Perfect. It's not sure to work. All I have to do is fire it up with the on button. So here we go. Let's push it. Alright, so it powered down. Let's take more some more watts. Lower the thing. Some sort of machine made of jungle parts. Looks like a Pokemon. You like it? Yes. I thought you might be the type. That's my chromatic. And just to be clear, it's the invention of the century. I have very unfortunate take on recycling. Though it doesn't do anything right now since out of power. I just had Watts, but my mommy won't give me any of hers. Next feature, everything is intended. All it takes is really 500 Watts to get the Karamatic up and running. I'll give you that. Oh, well, seriously, give me the 500 Watts I need. I'd take, it take me ages outdoors to collect 500 Watts and the outdoors for me. Well, let's just say our systems aren't compatible. But you, sorry, what was your name again? On pause. I guess you're more the outdoors type. I'll feed those watts he gave me to the Kramatic at once, and power on. Perfect. Just perfect. Put in four items you don't need, and you'll get one new item in exchange. If you put four, of, um, put in four of the apricorns that grow here on the Isle Marmor, then you might get a rare Pokeball if you're really lucky. Since you gave me the wads and all, feel free to use my chromatic as much as you like. Combine items. So now there's crafting and Pokemon. So let's combine berries, because I've got a lot of them. I got one of the new TRs. Um, user slams his target with flame covered body. The more you, the user outweighs the target, the greater the move's power. Hmm, that would be a really good move for, um. I forgot the Pokemon's name, but yeah. Um, the one that we had earlier that was Roy. Be really good for that. Um, so yeah, Mustard wants the battle. Um, we've basically only got Sally on this team. Hopefully that's enough, though. You ready for a battle? Yes. Alright, let's get this show started. This is the best way to get to know new students. I don't know how this battle is going to work. Like if it scales with me or me and me. B, I can't oh I just can't wait to see how you battle your heart out. So yeah, it looks like it skills more with me than, um, just random. So why do I have liquidation on this thing? Fake out did a lot. And I missed. Yep. I have pretty weak defense on Sally. Because it's not really EV trained or anything. So me and Fu's out, and Shinx is in. Not the Pokemon that I want to see. Hey, I forgot I have move animations turned off. I'll turn them back on once we get, um... Cup Fu. So yeah, I am going to switch this time into Eggy. It looks like my little old self's been quartered, getting the shivers. Oh yeah, isn't... No, me and Fu's fighting type. 
around in a second, but I... Do turn kinda hurt. Oh, that did so much damage. For you turn. Oof, super duper effective. Oh, I smell danger. That was a sentence. It's in headbutt. Oh wait, for um Slowpoke. I feel like that might have been a mistake to replace water pulse. That was everything I hoped for and more. Uh, I've lost. You're pretty strong, aren't you? Hey, the newbie won. Master wasn't going all out, but that's still pretty impressive. Is that kid anyway? The way you battle really shows me how much you care about your Pokémon. Even if you've come because of a misunderstanding, as long as you will to learn, then you're welcome at the Master Dojo. I think we can all help each other become stronger. I'm happy you've come to join us. And on that note, here's your Dojo uniform. How does Mustard know about the misunderstanding thing? That odd neat little fit right in with the students that my Master Dojo. Really, if you want to change or take a break, use that room over there. Now then, the pops here, the judges at max capacity. It's time to really start our training. You'll all be facing three trials. Wait, why is there a max capacity for the Stodra? There's more. The person who completes three trials will receive the secret armor of the Stodra. Secret armor I wanted. That's the spirit. Now let me explain the first trial. Master, you haven't given me my uniform yet. Why does that get a uniform but not me? It's not fair. I'm here, do you really out of a uniform? My bad, my bad. That's an easy fix, though. I have another uniform right here for you, Clara. It's way too well, it's grace. Uh... It's gone. Where'd my dojo uniform go? Huh? That speed, was it really a slowpoke? Never seen any slowpoke move so fast. Give it back, that's my dojo uniform. I liked how the music changed there. I just wasn't expecting that at all. Hey, get back here. Ooh, I guess I let them out of their Pokeballs a little too soon. So what's up with those slowpoke? This is the first trial, my students. You've all got to chase after those fast slowpoke to train with care by little old me. That's not all you need to defeat them, too. And while you're at it, could you get Claire's Dojo uniform back? We have to? Well, that's that. Do your best, you lot. It's just getting a slow poke. It can't be that difficult. Even if they are a bit fast. I'll change back into your usual clothes. Uh, no, I'll leave this on for now. Hey, I wonder how my hair got longer. Whatever. Maybe it's not longer and it's just fashion in that way. Um, and it was just able to fit there. Because, I mean, on the front it was a lot shorter. Um, though then again, I did have a hat on, so I don't actually know how long my hair was. To begin with. Could be wrong. Is what I'm saying. Okay, so... Time to go get the slowpoke. Um, they did not go that way. They went that way. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and save again. It has been like an hour. So. There's one of them. So if I've observed their pattern correctly, which who knows if I have. I'd only see them for a second. Oh, it's fast slow book. Defeat it and get take back the dojo uniform. Hey, Sally, we got this. It's a psychic type, so that's why I chose Pokemon 
only knows water type moves. Really unfortunate time to do that. Also, Sally's like half dead, so it's not too great. I might need to go back to the main island to grab some potions or something. Okay, so I got the jacket. Only two small Pokemon left. What is that Pokemon? Oh, it's a Dunsparce. Let's get one of those. Well, not right now, fortunately. I'm on a bit of a mission, Dunsparce. I'll get you eventually, though. Don't you worry about that. If there was like a Galarian Dunsparce, that would be kind of neat. I can actually catch up to this thing on my bike, I bet. I can, but it looks like uh, the hitbox. I have to run it to the front. Yep. It's a fast slowpoke. Okay, now it's time for the crit. I mean, I guess that works as well, but I accidentally used liquidation. So I'm not going to be doing too much damage. Uh, that's a lot more than I had thought. Oh, thank you, Slowpoke. I was gonna have to visit um, the main island or the dojo to get my HP restored, but that works as well. Poe. Dojo T in shorts. Only one fast Slowpoke left. So, I don't know where this other fast slowpoke is. I didn't know where those two were, so I'm just gonna continue heading this way, and yeah, that's where it was. Fast slowpoke, defeat it, and take back the Jojo again. I really like how this whole island is like the wild area where you've got the free cam and stuff. So yeah, this should take it out. I think, due to the rain. I wonder if you can catch a fast slowpoke. I'm assuming not. Got the gloves and light wear. So I've got the full uniform now. These whoopers. Okay, so I'm gonna be continuing this way. Back to the dojo. Got all of the fast slowpoke. So it's done. Hello there, honey and mustard. On pause, welcome back. You don't tell me you got my uniform back all on your own. Here you go. Oh, well, uh, thanks. Well, mustard on pause. Cleared the first trial like it was nothing. Well, I think it, this is the first time since Leon that someone was able to handle all three fast slowpoke on their own. The rest of you tried very hard too. You were able to catch up to the slowpoke, but I guess you couldn't defeat them. Tell you what, anyone who was able to catch up to the slowpoke at least gets one. Or at least once to get to pass. I was really out there himself, so it's only fair everyone else gets another chance. Try to make a fair comeback, everybody. Generous. Either way, I'm still out. That reminds me, honey, where are those little ones? Oh, that's right, darling. I nearly forgot. Portal Bulbasaur. Come on out, sweeties. Hmm. Okay. So, this is a bit of a decision. I think I'm gonna go with Venusaur. Or nothing to start with sword. Um uh, and I say there's more than a little curious about your strength as character. Why not pick one up for yourself? Okay, and so you know these two have been raised in a race for point when they evolve they'll be able to strike Animax. So yeah. That's why I don't really know which one to pick here. Um 
Because obviously Venusaur is a lot stronger than um, Blastoise competitively, and I will be using these competitively. Um, so yeah, it's just like Venusaur's got Sleep Powder, um, although Amoongus is now in the game, so it's a Sleep Powder threat as well. Um, but I think I will be going with uh, Bulbasaur. Oh wait, but they smile whenever you walk up next to them. Ah, that makes this decision a lot harder. I'm gonna go with Venusaur. Or Bulbasaur, I mean, I keep calling it Venusaur. Because uh, it's such big. Really going to go with actually Bulbasaur. It's first rate with grass type moves. Yes, and I have like a full team of water types as well. Bulba. Bulbasaur has become your Pokemon. Its data will be added to the Pokedex. Hmm. I'm gonna go with what I usually name Bulbasaurus. Bulbasaur looks pleased as punch that they are that you chose it. Remember that once you're or that your new Pokemon will be able to drag in a max once it's fully evolved. Be sure to raise it well. Dynamax. A serious phenomenon quite unique to the Pokemon of Galar. Then there's Gigantamaxing, a very special way of Dynamaxing for a very special Pokemon. Their moves change, of course, but their appearances change as well. Speaking of Gigantamax, there's that secret recipe of the Master Trojo. Drinking it makes your gigantic and strong. I call it Max Soup. I'd like, um, I'd love to have a bowl of Max Soup full of Max Mushrooms right now. Sure, it's been a while. That's why your second trial should be mushroom picking. Max mushrooms are the key to gigantic magazine, and I'm tasking you finding three. Max mushrooms are red with spiral pattern. I'm pretty sure they grow in dark, humid places. And with that, uh, your next trial is again. I will be counting on you. Oh, well. Don't worry, Squirtle. I'll be sure to raise you with lots of love. Make sure um, you are so strong. Or I'll make you also strong so I don't ever lose ball before. Um, I won't be too sure about that. Sonny, if you want that Pokemon to learn your moves, you can leave that to me. Weren't you just the sweetest thing? That lovely line is always so kind. Give him a bit of arm, or arm right or it will teach your darling Pokemon a new move. So arm right or is basically like currency, I guess, that's outside of Poke Dollars. This is a BP recycling, also cost that. So yeah, we're gonna go to boxes here, and we're gonna get rid of Shark Sharky, uh, just because Sharky hasn't really done much on the team as of yet. Um, we're keeping Steve just because it's the Galarian Slowpoke, and I feel like eventually it'll have something. Also, it does have Pokerus at the moment. Oh, my whole team has Pokerus at the moment. Um, that's interesting. Um, except for Bulbasaur, obviously, as Bulbasaur just got here. Wouldn't expect it to have Pokerus. Special attack up, special defense down. I will have to fix that ability. Um, I don't know what to yet. I'm thinking speed up, attack down. I don't know what ability that is called, though. Um, I want to have Bulbasaur at the first of my party, but at the same time, I actually want to be able to want to fight. So, sadly, that won't be able to happen. But yeah, I think going with Bulbasaur is the play. So yeah, next thing is getting three mushrooms. Max mushrooms to be specific. And pause, my bad, my bad. It's not to me that, you, um, that you're brand new to the album, but you have no idea where to even begin looking for max mushrooms. I'm just going to walk and I'll show you some mushroom hot spots. Dang, mustard just kind of carrying me here. Oh, there's a chest find. That pillar over there. Um, dumb, dumb DD. Didn't read the bottom part. Now, usually the forest folks is chock full of max mushrooms, but the thing is, this form of greed that came through and ate up your last one here. So I'm thinking maybe you'll have more luck finding max mushrooms if you check the form of tunnels on the other side of the forest. Watch where you're going in the forest. Okay, it's easy to get lost. 
Yeah, good luck with the or with the hunt of Max Rushrooms. Uh, catch you back at the dojo. This path actually isn't too linear. Um, I guess we'll give that to Bulbasaur for now. Um, yes, I'll give it to Sally, you know, who doesn't need it. Actually, giving that to Bulbasaur is a bad idea. Is Bulbasaur a poison type right now, or is Bulbasaur truly grass? Okay, so Bulbasaur does have a bit of poison in him. So that's good. Hello there, Venipede. Goodbye. Okay, so the weary are trying to get to the other side of the forest. Oh, there's a Primarin. Big mushroom, although not a max mushroom. Shred shell. What's the shred shell for? I don't think that it's too useful for my Pokemon currently. Let's say I already have one. See if Jolly was special or attack instead of special attack, then it would be good there. Um, they must book one switch out without fail. Oh. I have two focus actions for play anyone know that. So heat crash and focus blast, neither one too important. So Sally coming up. I was, I was wondering if anyone else could. It's in Headbutt. Muddy Water. Is Muddy Water special? It is, but it's 85 accuracy. Okay. That is good to know. Um. Warpool is not that good of a move. Snore. Definitely want to teach her things Solar Beam, and then I guess Magical Leaf as well. To replace Mind Warp. Because Bulbasaur is usually special attacker, if I remember correctly. Could be wrong. But yeah, I haven't made a Bulbasaur team yet. I've wanted to, though. Um. For a bit of time. No way, I did make a Bulbasaur team, I think I made a Sun team using Bulbasaur. Though I'm not too sure if I put Bulbasaur on that team or not. Ta da. Yeah, that was a Pikachu. Is it shiny? Nope. Why am I not surprised that it's here? Pretty bad. The background's really nice, though. My really nice is kind of an overstatement. On the field, I was looking around there. And then again, like, look at these rocks. Like, the f plants are somewhat nice, but the rocks and this, like, wall here in front of me and the ground without the plants and the grass and everything. 
Then I just go back to the entrance. Hope not. I might have. I think I did. No, because I would have gotten that apricorn. Oh, there, Venipede. Goodbye, Venipede. But yeah, um, Simeon was already in the game. I remember that because Warren Blur was in the game. Because it had, um, Instruct. Whatever. So the Pokemon would use a move twice. Oh, that's the way it was supposed to be going. Galoratia Twig. Material for... Or it's the material for an accessory for a certain Pokemon. So it's not the complete... thing that's needed, it's just part of it. This is the only time that we're gonna see this tower, so I'm pretty sure this is single strike tower, and we're gonna be going for the... Multi strike. But this also. No, wait, it wasn't correct. Because this also is not the correct path. Okay, so we're here for the max mushrooms. Or dust crawl, I will definitely take one of those. A tragagal, whatever it's called. Shamsy. Rare bone. Diglet. Six more diglets in Brawler Cave. I'll probably pass by a few, but I mean, I'm not actually looking for them or anything. Big left over there. Super potion. Okay, so we actually can heal a Pokemon now. <laughs> That's been a bit of an issue. Iron Tail. Definitely something I could sell. Five more in the Brawler Cave. I'm just looking for the mushrooms. Oops. I think I went to the wrong way as well. Oh, for the mushrooms. And bottle behind. That's actually pretty good. Does this count as in Brawler's Cave? I'm pretty sure it does. It does. Challenge room. What was that sound? Was that rock rough? It sounded like keys rattling, so I'm guessing it was the clef key, but then again, I don't really see clef key. Metal coat. Oh, good Celix. I have heard that Scyther got added back in, so I'm assuming it's just evolving Scyther in disguise. Oh, hello there, Lycanroc. Edgy Lycanroc. Yeah. Oh, Edgy Lycanroc is fast. Never mind. Um, don't run into anything. Okay, there we go. Got a big nugget, piece of armor, right? So, yeah, we did go the wrong way. But it's fine. At least there's no random encounters in the games. It's me there. Okay, so... Oh, Diglett. You might find all the Diglets in here. Was it Brothers Cave that we needed to be headed to? There's only one more Diglett left in here. So. I wonder what you get for all the Diglets. Probably just a Diglett. No, wait. I think I heard that you get... I don't know, Lolan 
form of a Pokemon with a hidden ability. Oh, I could be wrong. I think it's like a random form. It's not just Diglett. I haven't run into any trainers on this island, which is interesting. So I would assume I'd just be running into them constantly. But yeah, we didn't find any max mushrooms in that cave. Water. I mean, muddy water's not too bad. It's just that I'm not using my load egg right now. So yeah, this is where we started. Then I did not go this way. So this was probably the way that I was supposed to go. Wishing peaks. Oh, hello there, Dan Growth. Wink. Leaf stone. That'll replace some of the leaves earlier. That's how I find a shiny. Execute. I swear this is where they said to get the mushroom. Maybe it'll show it on the map. Get max weapons. Oh, warm up till. I was trying to visit without exploring the map, or without using the map too much, but yeah, it's just like directly north. Uh, I'm pretty sure this way is north. I could use the tower if it's on the map. It's a point of reference. So yeah, the tower, which is in front of me, is right there. So if I face this way, then the tower is on my right, and it should be on my right. So that means I am heading in the correct direction. Back into the forest. Correct. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have to go through the forest and then just stay on the right. Not now, but cool. Right wall, I think I'll get there. Hug the right wall. Okay, so we kind of ended up in a different location. That was an incorrect way for me to travel. Yeah, um, hmm. I'm not too sure where to go, actually, because if I just travel directly north of here, that way is south, so if I go to my left, and I go north, right, that just takes me back to where I was. I guess maybe I continue to head north. I was traveling south, actually, so it does make sense why I didn't arrive at the destination that was to my north. Proceed to approach the situation with logic, although that can be a bit difficult for me at times. Okay, so this not north, but if I turn a bit to the right, then we're traveling north. So yeah, this way is north, which means the cave is that way, which... It 
is not that cave. It is the other cave that's nearby. There is another cave nearby, right? Yep, yeah, that cave down there. That I've passed like 15 times now, probably. Well, nobody's really said anything. But I mean, it's fine. Bottle of Moo Moo Milk. It's like I got one of the ID numbers. So here we go. This three max mushrooms in one spot. Here, I thought I need gotta find them one by one. I saw those mushrooms first, I swear. I've been at the dojo longer and all, so it's only fair that you let me have them, right? Wait, so yeah, I figured you'd say that. If you're a real pain in the neck, you just show up out of nowhere and just happen to be young and talented. If you're looking to get in my way, well, I think I have some viral poisons that can take care of that. Psychic type. They're both straight here. I'll show you once and for all that I'm the better trainer. Freeze. Would have been funny. I thought that missed for a second because it took a while to make a sound. I actually like the machine. That's kind of more important for your singles and doubles. I thought I taught it really early. No, I taught it magical. This is the most important move. So. Also, Bubba will be evolving after this, so that's pretty good. go to the move relearner if I need to. World of heat. Am I really gonna lose again? It's just, is there something wrong with me? Careful not to miss here. And a keyboard mode for sure. Just wonder if you got that I don't. Oh, was well. So it's that it will be added to the Pokedex. Why can't I win? I'm trying to start as a can, what am I missing? Fine, you can have those silly mushrooms, I'm gonna find better ones anyway. There. Three clusters of max mushrooms. Oh, 
Bluetooth. It says on Pa's phone, how's the trial coming along? Love, easy peasy. We'd have already managed to find three max mushrooms. I'm checking on everyone's progress, but it seems you're in first place once again. You really are a new rising star, aren't you? I suppose I'd better go put the pot stove, but be careful on your way back. Yep, I'll be super careful. But first... Boost the power of super effective moves, and then go in. Not that that item is too oh. useful. Welcome back, so you now the trial. Congrats on finding the Max Mushrooms. Trial number two with no problem for you. Now the students ended up getting lost in the forest. Turns out Max Mushrooms was the least of their problem. Shame, but I guess everybody other than Impossible failed the trial. Well, first things first, proper meal. Let's have the Max Mushrooms made into delicious Max soup, shall we? Really outdone myself this time. Now let's have to add those lovely max mushrooms he brought us. Can you please wait? Fire, what in the world has gotten into you? I've never seen you in such a flutter. I've got some max mushrooms too. I sparked an area must have hard for those. We seen the second person in the past. Um, did it. Did it. Should not darling Flora, you did it. This is a cause for celebration. Sunny, please, can I ask for something just once? I want you to use my max mushrooms in the max soup. I really want everyone to, sh right, to share my hard work with everybody here. Right. Well, if that's all you're after, then I'm perfectly happy to oblige for this. It's hardly the first time you've asked for something, and I don't rather doubt it'll be the last time. I hope you don't feel that your thunder is being stolen and paused, but we're a family here and family share, so I'll go ahead and use Clara's mushroom for today. Just so rare for to try hard at something. I really want to reward that. You understand, don't you? You can hold on to the max mushrooms you found. I'm sure you'll find a good use for them. Don't worry, it's still totally fast to trial with flying colors. Think of the max mushrooms as an extra reward. Uh, those clouds are a bit strange. The max mushroom suit. So, oh, I'm fine with time to dig it. You enjoyed the max soup. Oh, I never did explain the big deal about the max soup. And, uh, you see, when one drinks the show's famous beer, you feel dynamax energy boiling up from inside you. No, you don't. That's just the kind of thing that doesn't happen if a human eats soup. But there's things are a bit different when certain Pokemon drink the soup. You see, there are some Pokemon that have distinct potential. When they drink the soup, their um, dynamax form will change into a Gigantamax form. Oh, so that can take Pokemon that can usually Gigantamax. And, like, if you didn't catch the Drake Animax version. Oh, okay, I'm glad that I waited, like, three months to get Dynamax Colossal with the ability that I needed. That's good. Keep one of the RF4 lads, or I'll keep one of our lads in the kitchen on soup duty from now on, too. You can ask him to serve you up a fresh bowl of Max soup whenever you need. Now then, let's wrap things up. You all did your best in the second trial. I'm proud of everyone here. Last but not least, thanks for the soup, honey. By the way, pause. Meet me in my room when you have a moment. Hey, so yeah, so far everything's gone pretty well. Let's see. Got the max soup. Got a bit lost in the forest, so for a minute running in a circle because there were two caves right next to each other. Okay, so... Let's see. There you are, Pons Clara. Thanks for coming. So what's this all about, Master? Why do you want to tell us? Right, well I've decided that you two will now take the Master Dojo's final, last, ultimate, third trial. Final, last, ultimate, third trial. What's that? Uh, so basically this is the last trial. Uh, well, yes. That's the gist of it. 
You two are the only ones who successfully finished the second trial. You've pushed each other to greater heights and helped each other grow. So I'd say it's time to finally see who's stronger in a Dynamax Pokemon battle. Run to battle, that's the last trial. Yep, the rules are simple, whoever wins will complete the trial. I'll be granted the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Is it final? Can I? Battle will be held in the battle court behind the Master Dojo. The court is power spot, so you can Dynamax your heart's content. Gotta get going. I need to go there right away to clear my heart for this. I'm going on ahead, okay? You can waste about like a soap book. Take as much time as you need. So yeah, um, we're gonna give Sally Dynamax soup. Uh, she's got talent for sure, but it's caused her to slack off. Never felt the need to try hard on anything, I guess. Even with her training at the dog show, I can tell she's been just doing the bare minimum. Things have changed since you arrived on pause. Maybe you've helped awaken some sort of passion and drive in her, right? Still, I hope that motivation isn't put toward anything mischievous. So yeah, I'm gonna save here before I give the Dynamax suit. And I'm also gonna fix up my team setup. Oh wait, I can give the Dynamax suit to Charizard as well. The shiny Charizard that I have. Because it's not a Dynamaxable Pokemon at the moment. I think we still use Sally though. It will be very nice to have him being able to Dynamax though. I also have a hidden ability one on my Switch Lite. Yep. Oh, so you can give it to the Eevees and stuff as well, because I didn't get a uh, Gigantamax Eevee. If this Inteleon drinks Max Soup, it'll become capable of Gigantamaxing. I'll use the three clusters of Max Mushrooms to make Max Soup, is that alright? Oh, so it takes all three Mushrooms. But that's fine. Oh, okay, so that's how the Max Mushrooms work. So yeah, I'll need to get some more of them. But, now Sally can check out a Max. Although, okay, so it does fit, say it there. Okay, so now it's time to get ready for the final battle of the Trials. Just by saving. I think this shot's supposed to look impressive, but with the rock textures, it just kinda doesn't. We're here. When I beat you, I'll get the secret armor, and then I'll become a poison type gym leader. Gotta win, no matter what. I'm gonna go all out and totally beat you. Ready? Looks like the two of you are ready. Good luck. Me cheering for both of you. Right, to take your places. So I don't know how this Dynamax works for Sally. Master Dodo's final trial. Ready? Pokemon Trainer Clock. So it's starting out with a score B. Or how do you pronounce that actually? So yeah, that's not a Pokemon that can trick Animax. I'm not holding a single thing back anymore. Time to settle this fair and square. Maybe watch your step looks like some toxic spikes and I'll got on the battle court. Oh, so it poisoned on switch, and that's not really how toxic spikes work, but okay. does kind of not bode well for my original plan. Just have to make do with it. I've got a poison cure if I need it. Oh, 
I'll just see how much damage poison does. Okay, so that only did like 10. Okay, you need a crit here. Oh, so it's... Okay, so that is actually pretty bad. that I have, like the X stuff, or do I have, okay, so I do have some X things, but yeah, there's no reason to use it at the moment. Might as well go for a swift here, this should be enough to take it out, I think. Yeah. in Charizard, but I'm not going to. There's no reason to read the super effect of text or whatever, but, um, oh yeah, I forgot the ice types are super effective against bugs, so I was kind of confused for a second. I mean, it would make sense if it was. I should have turned on move animations for this. There's no way I'm losing, I let him go to the better end. Quick drop, watch out audience, one dose of Polaris poison and there's no turning back. makes poison, so half a second. Here comes a full piece of venom. Oof. Okay. I thought I was so sure the Dynamax animations even when the animations turned off. But it didn't. Victor has been decided. When to complete the third trial, it's you and pause. Oh, well done. You gave it both your all. Or you both gave it your all. And I totally lost. Uh, well, this stinks. I do everything, even cheat a little and still lose. Don't expect a young, talented kid like you to really get it, but it's really trying, you know, as hard as I could. Maybe it's just time for me to give up on my dream of becoming a gym leader. Once they find out what I did, I'll be expelled from the gym training. Oh, you can tell the master that I cheated. Well, huh? Why? It was supposed to be a fair battle. I cheated just so I could win. You're stringing the pause kindness towards both your Pokemon and your rivals. Seriously? 
You should apologize to Karen's Five too as her master. What she did was wrong, but she didn't just want it be beaten by her rival, that's all. She was a good, hard-working student. Thank you. Sorry, and pause. Your punishment, Claire, you're going to look after a Pokemon in Johto for six months by yourself. I mean, you know, it's just like somebody were to do that at the Olympics or whatever. Or maybe this is the non scale of the Olympics. I don't know how this dojo is treated in the Pokemon universe, but I mean, I doubt that it's. you know, in a position to where something like scattering toxic spikes on the battlefield at least twice before a match. It's fair. But I mean, yeah, that's a lot of work, but is that all? Of course. Let's work on strengthening your heart. Uh, okay. Right, everyone, things are settled here. I'm gonna both of you, you've mustered so much effort and tried so hard. And so teared up, I couldn't even see half the battle, but I saw what it mean. Pause. You gave it your best in triumphs, even when facing a fair challenge. To you, who has completed all the trials, grant the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Take some time to prepare, so I'll go ahead and get everything ready. That's all, game, as you were. Pause. Um, I, well... Get Claire's lead card. I was wondering if you would get a lead card from her. You're really strong. Oh, and then we're just instantly here. But yeah, get Claire's lead card. Flip the card. Read this you want to. Um, well, I'm not going to read it out loud, I'm just kind of reading it on my own here. There you are, keeping this old man waiting. So, Alright, since you have played Alter Trial, I'll give you the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Now then, come on out. Not really armor. This Pokemon is, in fact, the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Say hello to Cub. No, I know it's tiny. Raise it with diligence and it will become strong enough to see you through any battle. Just like a suit of armor, no opponent will be able to get past it. This one in particular has an amazing potential problem is it's a bit shy. It doesn't seem to have much confidence in itself. So I was seeing them once. Maybe if it joins you on your adventure, let a pop break out of its shell a bit. Take care of Cub, okay? It's in your hands now. That will be added to the Pokedex. Cub food trains hard to perfect its moves. The moves it masters will determine which form it takes when it evolves. No nickname for Cub food. What level is Cub food? I wonder. Doesn't say. Now then, first thing you'd, for you to do is become the best friend of Cub food. You need to build trust. Cub food hasn't really had a chance to explore the world outside the desert. So be able to help you become better friends if you have whatever look around. Maybe take it to a spot that has a great view of Isle of Armor. With my students standing in good spots, so keep an eye out. Of course, having battles or camping out together will also help you become more friendly for it sooner. Also, oh, I know. Grant you permission to keep a Pokemon out of its Pokeball here on the Isle of Armor. Now let the Pokemon at the head of your team out of its Pokeball and take it for a stroll. Be great friends, or you'll be friends in no time. Or if you walk together, go and take Cub to 
Margo and take Kub a stroll with Kung Fu Pai one. Um, once your best buddies start Kung Fu's training in earnest, if you stop by me, let me know once you're ready. So yeah, it's been two hours, and um, I must have mispronounced words now, so I think now it's a good time to in the stream after I take like one step outside, just to see what it's like. And also check Cup Two summary. Oh, I just realized that the Pokemon in my party have Poke Rest, don't they? So yeah, I can't actually have them in my party. For now, at least. Just because I don't want Cup Two catching Poke Rest. At least not yet. So, yeah, um, what, uh, Rock Smash Layer and Dwarf Focus Energy, kind of a bad move set. it's also kind of special attack, up and attack down, which, you know, is kind of the opposite of what I need. Um, or, let's see, do I have a good mint? I doubt it, but maybe. And what item did I get? Oh, I got all these items. Iron's not too useful here. Alright, I got Lonely, its attack will grow more easily, but defense more slowly. Which is not what it needs to be, either. Um, so, yeah, and then TMs, I got Iron Tail. Anything that Kubfu can learn that's any good, that headbutt, it's not too good for Kubfu. Learn Taliate. Good. U turn's actually pretty solid. Um, imagine if you um do focus energy and then you like draw the move away and then you um Gigantamax Cub Fu into its Gigantamax move and then one shot your opponent's Shrek Animax Pokemon through Max Guard. I think that's something that can happen, because I think you can. Um. Get critical hit Shrek Animax moves. I was trying to think what to say there. Um, so yeah, I'll get rid of Leer. But yeah, like you get, um, Rage Powder or something. Into that. I don't know if that's a thing, but it sounds pretty strong if it is. Okay, so yeah, nothing else. Okay, so, yeah, um, for now I will be ending the stream here. Um, just because tomorrow I'm going to be waking up a bit earlier to get ready for the Smash presentation, and then playing the character after that, and then um, I will also be playing Pokemon tomorrow, um, since I wasn't able to finish everything tonight. So yeah, I guess I'll see everyone then.